All right, hey, uh, this is Anthony Lyons of uh, AL Designs, and I got a, uh, another build for you guys. I'm gonna probably start doing some more videos for uh, people to see some of the things I've been doing and working on. Uh, this current project is a 1964 Impala, um, very nice vehicle. Um, so what I did for the customer on this one is uh, <clears throat> I started with a center console. And the center console has the radio up top and it has his air ride controller uh, down in this little pocket area. Um, came out pretty nice. The sides are wrapped in vinyl. Um, has two vinyl pieces on the left and right. Um, and the middle's painted in, um, to make it look like plastic. The center piece that holds the uh, controller is wrapped in suede. Um, give it a nice little effect. Uh, contrast <clears throat> the panels actually pop off and they have magnets on the inside so that I can access the mounting and the wiring and so forth um, and then it just snaps right back on the other thing inside the uh, inside the vehicle is we have these kick panels <clears throat> these nice kick panels it's hard to see because it is black everything in this car is black the car is black itself but we have these kick panels that um, have the speakers that sit behind it. Um, I'll also have some pictures to follow up on the video so you'll see a little bit better pictures of step by step how I did the, uh, the kick panels. Uh, the one cool part feature about everything in this car that you'll see is you'll see the center console and the kick panels will all light up with accent lighting. Um, so there's a mixture of grill uh grill mesh grill cloth plexiglass and then of course vinyl wrap for the kick panel um and so forth um next i'll show you the rear deck and so now here's same as the kick panels you have the rear deck um which has uh six by nines uh that are underneath it you have the grill uh the plexiglass and then the vinyl wrap panels um under the center panel here is a bolt that actually holds the whole unit in place um, and that's why I did the transition there but um, came out pretty nice uh, speakers come through sound everything um, just to match the front kick panels though you have your accent lining in the same basic shape that we got in the kick panel now on to the trunk go so now we have the trunk the last part of the build was the trunk and again, you have the same exact shape that you got going on for the kick panels as well as the lighting. And then uh, each, behind each panel on the left and right are 10-inch subwoofers, um, Rocker Fosgate subwoofers. And then you, of course, have a display of his air ride system with uh, the uh, tank and the compressor and whatnot. And then everything's wrapped in the same black vinyl. And then also we have a really nice carpet on the um, bottom. So if anyone wants anything done with some type of classic vehicle or any vehicle, just let me know. It's uh, again, AL Designs. Um, <clears throat> again, this is a 64 uh, Impala. And you've got, um, like I said, accent lining everywhere. You've got nice vinyl wrapped panels, carpet. If you look through from the from the inside, you have this nice glow here. I can even turn the lights off. Get you up there. Get a little video of that. Everything came out pretty good. Sounds good. And we can even detail your car as well. If you look, my father and I detailed the, got it detailed and cleaned up pretty good. Car was full of sawdust, but uh, came out pretty good. So again, uh, hit me up at AL Designs. Catch you later.